Hi, I'm Joe Elliott, lead developer here at Zoom Photo, and I want to show you one of our new cool photo finder features. At Zoom Photo, we're constantly improving our system to help you find your photos. Uh, using the latest in uh, facial recognition technology, you can now search for your photos based on other photos we found or taken at an event. For with FoamFest, for example, many uh, times bibs are obscured by foam or mud, or they've just fallen off. So our indexers are unable to tag you in the pictures. But we still took those photos, so we want to make sure that you have them. So I just want to show you an example of how this works. Uh, let's pretend that this is me, and this is from Foam Fest taken in Ottawa uh, in 2017. And here's how this works. First, we want to find a picture of ourselves, uh, preferably with as few faces as possible. And the reason for that is our facial recognition system will look at all the faces in the photo and display results for all of them. So if we pick one, let's say we pick this picture here. Let's open it up. So let's, let's pretend I'm this guy, 37390, because that one's tagged. I can click this button here, search face database for more. And just give it a second and it pulls up more pictures. So obviously it's going to pull all these ones because they look very similar. It's going to pull these ones, which if you take a look, if this is me, I am indexed in. Oh, now it's pulling. So this here would be me on the lily pads. So this is really simple to do. I can just copy and paste my bib number in there, submit a correction. This is me again, submit a correction. Now these here are not me, but you can see how similar these faces get and how it, you know, the system thinks that that could be me. These, this here is me. So just in one quick second, I have found some more pictures of myself and was able to add them. This is so much easier than having to go through the quick links myself. I let the system do the work. Now, how it works is bib numbers separated by a space is what we want. And after I submit this correction, um, it's going to go to our staff and they're going to either approve or reject the correction. So sometimes people will type in all sorts of stuff and hit submit. That's not what we want. All we want is the bib number. And if there are two people, bib number with a space. This sat FZ 1030 just means Saturday foam zone 1030 AM. And that goes to the quick link of the unknown person. In this case, it's this gentleman here in the black. We have no idea who he is because he doesn't have a number at all. But what's neat is, so this gentleman here in the black, we could find out who he is or at least what pictures he's in and do the same process. We just don't have a picture of him with his bib to start. But if this was me and I knew what my bib was, I would be able to just go here, one, two, three, four, five, or whatever I was, and hit submit. So that's a quick overview of our facial recognition system and how it works and how it will work for Foam Fest and give you an idea of how we use it so that you can use it to add yourself to your pictures. Again, this is Joe Elliott from Zoom Photo. Thank you very much. Have a great day.